Minister God's Power Alfred Ugbokri has come to the Synagogue Church of All Nations with the problem of HIV AIDS positive 1. You can see the medical report which states that he has been screened and confirmed through a Western blood test to be positive to HIV AIDS stage 1. All the punishment that Jesus Christ received during and before his crucifixion were for our healing, spirit, soul and body. Let us listen to him as he explains his problem. My name is Gospower Alfred Ugokri. I'm 41 years old. I have HIV positive one. TB Joshua begins to pray for Mr. Alfred in the power of the Holy Spirit, releasing him from a life of affliction. He stretches forth his hands in accordance with the book of Acts 4 verse 30 which says, stretch out your hand to heal that signs and wonders may be done through your holy servant, Jesus Christ. You are free. The man of God declares them free and they move around exercising themselves to show that God has taken them out of sickness into perfect health. I'm somebody. I'm okay, sir. Mr. Alfred is free in Jesus' name. My name is G.A. Ogbokri. The problem that brought me to synagogue is problem of HIV positive one. I contacted this disease through fornication and adultery. It was on September 7 that our father-in-law worked on me. The symptom that I was feeling before our father-in-law worked for me is constant headache, constant malaria, internal heat, I can't sleep well, etc. and etc. After our father-in-law worked on me, all the symptoms vanished. I went back to the same hospital. Then I tested negative. He displays the two medical reports indicating that he once had HIV AIDS and the other indicating that he has been healed in Jesus' name. To God be the glory. Fifteen years later, Mr. Alfred Ogbokri came back to the Synagogue Church of All Nations to glorify God for the miraculous healing he received from HIV AIDS and the blessed life he has been living since then. Let's listen to his testimony. Praise the Lord. My name is Gospel Alfred Ogbokri. I am 58 years old. I am a businessman. I came to Synagogue Church of All Nations 50 years ago with the problem of HIV positive one. I contacted this disease through fornication and adultery. The symptom that I was feeling them are headache, rashes all over my body, sleep at nights, and so on and so forth. I was diagnosed HIV positive at Lagos. A teaching hospital in the Araba. When I came to the Synagogue Church of All Nations, I was arranged at the prayer line. Our father in the Lord, Prophet T.B. Joshua, laying hands on me and he prayed for me. Immediately, all the symptoms that I was feeling before, God vanished. I thank God for what he have done in my life. After some times, I went back to Lagos State Teaching Hospital to rerun the test again. I tested negative. I thank God for what you have done in my Shall life. Shall we put our hands together for the master healer? When you were tested positive HIV 15 years ago, how did you feel? Well, I feel the end have come until I got to the Synagogue Church of Foundation when our father in the Lord lay his hand on me. And how did you got to know about Synagogue Church? The hospital that I tested uh, positive, Lagos uh, Teaching Hospital, the doctor told me about the synagogue, that uh, medically disease, the disease have no uh, cure that I should come to Synagogue Church of All Nations. And when this advice was given to you by the same doctor who tested you positive 15 years ago, that you should go to the synagogue church, how did you feel? Well, 
I feel that uh, with God, all things are possible. And after your healing, did you manage to go back to the same doctor yes, to yes, show yes. yourself? Yes, I went back to the same hospital, to the same doctor. I rerun the text, and the result is negative. And what did your doctor, who advised you to come? He was, uh, he was happy with me. He rejoiced uh, with me. Yes, once again, tell us, um, for the benefit of those who are watching, who are listening, give us a word of advice. You that you were once given a certificate of death, and today, by the power of resurrection in the life of the servant, Prophet T.B. Joshua, who prayed for you today, Christ Jesus has issued you the certificate of life. Can you give these people who are waiting today an advice? Well, first of all, I will advise everybody to abstain from the sin of fornication and adultery because it's the major cause. And they should have believed, they should have been trusted in God. God will heal them in Jesus' name. Amen. I believe that uh, we, they are listening to you because it is very, very easy to receive the healing, but sometimes difficult for people to maintain their healing. Can you advise them once again? How did you manage to maintain this, your healing for the past 15 years? And today we can see you, you are healthy, you are standing to the glory of God to testify. Can you just give those people the, the secrets behind the life that you are enjoying right now? Well, everything belongs to God. After the prayer from uh, our Father in the Lord, they should abscond from sin. I think that's all I can say. Yes, I believe that they are also listening to you because uh, indeed uh, sin is the root cause of whatever situation that uh, they are having right now. And we can see to the glory of God that uh, you have received God's pardon, which is full and free. And that is why we can testify to the glory of God today for your life. And we give all the glory to God Almighty who has indeed healed you and delivered you. How has your healing affected your family members, your relative, your wife and your children? After my healing, I feel okay, I am all right, my family is all right, my business is moving on fine, and I'm healed, I'm hearty. I thank Almighty God. And you know that you are healed to follow Jesus. Yes, madam. We thank God for your life. Can you tell us once again the medical reports you have at your left-hand side? Start from the first one. The first one is the one that proved that I tested positive. And after the, the second healing, one, after the healing, is the one that uh, proved that I tested negative. And the third one is confirmation that I tested negative. So you mean you are having two different medical reports proving that you are negative to HIV AIDS? Exactly. I'm having two reports at the same hospital Alleluia. that I tested negative. To God by the glory. And right now, can you remove the medical report to the glory of God and show our sisters and brothers who are today waiting for their own healing. Continuamos con unos poderosos testimonios aquí en la Sinagua Iglesia de todas las naciones. Este hombre en este momento, como pueden observar, es un testimonio más de la enfermedad de VIH, SIDA positivo. En este momento está viendo cómo le está mostrando a los demás pacientes de VIH, SIDA positivo, su certificado médico. Hace 15 años se recibió oración por parte del hombre de Dios, el profeta TV Joshua. Dice que inmediatamente que recibió ese toque de sanidad y resurrección en el nombre poderoso de Jesucristo, todo síntoma desapareció, dolores de cabeza, problemas de mareos, problemas de, de, de comezón en la piel, entre muchos otros, por no mencionarlos, fueron inmediatamente desvanecidos de su cuerpo. Y hoy para la gloria de Dios viene a dar este testimonio con dos certificados médicos confirmando que es completamente negativo, que no padece más de esta enfermedad de VIH, SIDA positivo 1. Esto es de hace 15 años y nos explica que la razón de cual adquirió este problema es por la fornicación y el adulterio. Gloria a Dios, continuamos con más testimonios de VIH SIDA aquí en la Sinagua Iglesia de todas las naciones. Continuamos. Este hombre está en de mostrar su certificado a las otras personas que están aquí en atento de su guérison. Él ha ido a hacer el test dos veces después de su guérison, después que el profeta haya ido a lo toucher. La brother who has just given his testimony moving his medical report around uh, to show those who are waiting today for their own healing. Remember, divine healing is a supernatural power of God, bringing health to human body, and that is 
the transformation that has taken place in the life of our brother 15 years ago when he came with a problem of HIV AIDS, positive one, and he had just mentioned series of symptoms that he was suffering from. And today, Christ Jesus in his infinite mercy has healed him. He also explained that when he was tested HIV, the same doctor who confirmed him to be having this problem advised him to come to the synagogue church of all nations because he believed that God Almighty is, is indeed using his able servant prophet TV Joshua to heal people with all manner of sickness. And today you can see her brother here standing to the glory of God with his medical reports stating that he is no longer having HIV AIDS. Sir, can you tell us once again, you said you were, you received your healing how many years ago? I my healing about 15 years ago, 15 years ago. Wow. We thank God for your life. And uh, we also want to remind you once again that remember that uh, you were healed by Christ's word. You should continue to be ruled by the word. And we we'll pray with you that God Almighty will continue to grant you that wonderful grace to maintain this new life that you have received. Remember, you were healed to follow Jesus Christ. You were healed for the glory of God. Amen. Please, I want to sing a song, maybe. Everybody testify, you are good. You are good, Jehovah, you are good. Everybody testify, you are good. You are good, Jehovah, you are good. Praise the Lord. 